I think he developed a whole new generation of Titans fans mm -hmm. just by, by the way he played and the excitement he brought. 4-2-4. Four, four. I've never four, seen, two, I, I literally have never seen a time that fast. You, you cannot, under any circumstance, let him get free. If you let him get two steps, he's going to turn it into 20 and then at 20 and then to 100 to the end zone. There was no second gear, there was no third gear, there was a handoff, and there was sixth gear. He's a guy that can go zero to 60 like that. I saw him, and then in a glimpse, he was gone. There aren't many players in football where you just kind of hold your breath whenever Chris Johnson gets on the edge. If you take a wrong step, the next step you take is getting an angle down the sideline because he'll outrun you to the sideline. Chris Johnson, breathtaking runner, has the ability to break one every time he touches the ball. I'll tell you what, this guy is scary. It's amazing. I, all the tape and film we watched over the course of the week, you see a lot of great players in the National Football League, a lot of guys that could really run. But clearly, when you watch a player like Chris Johnson, I mean, the film does not lie. He has unusual speed when he gets into the secondary. Well, it's never seen before speed at this position. But this guy in the open field is very dangerous. He's got great vision, he has patience to let those, set those blocks up, and when he hits it, boy, is he hard to catch. With the 24th pick in the 2008 NFL Draft, Tennessee Titans select Chris Johnson, running back, East Carolina. On first down, Chris Johnson up the middle of the park. In the last territory for foot race. It's amazing, though. In preseason game, his rookie year, when he popped a long run right off the bat. I'd never seen a player that fast before. Putting it in the hands of a guy who can change things in a hurry like Johnson. Anytime it's a foot race between you and him, you lose. There's one thing to be fast, but there's... A totally another level for Chris Johnson. It's almost as if if he gets to the second level of the defense, it's over. Yeah, they've got to make him stop and cut. Otherwise, he'll outrun the angle on guys, and they're not going to catch him from behind. It's just They're just not. Everybody remembers watching the seemingly uneventful combine, and then this guy just ran what? Chris Johnson, one of the fastest times ever at the NFL Combine, deadly in the open field. 4.24 was his time, and had a fabulous rookie year. Chris Johnson, right side, inside five, five eight, touchdown! It was fast on film, and you know, on film you could slow it down, and he was still fast. Here he is, Johnson. Well, this is what makes Chris Johnson just so dangerous. No way in the world you think he can get all the way back to the outside. Johnson will cut back the other way, and the speedy Johnson with a first down. Hands it off. Johnson trying to bounce it outside. Down the line. Uh oh, watch out. See you later. Touchdown. There's 70,000 people in this stadium, all but 11 of them. Saw Chris Johnson standing by himself. Nobody's covering Chris Johnson. There he goes again. Breakaway speed. And he'll jog in the end zone. Touchdown. This does before it gets great. And uh, Johnson again. Watch out. You start, really, you start with this guy, Chris Johnson. He made a huge splash last year as a rookie. Kerry Collins knows where Chris Johnson is. When you get him the football, everybody in the stadium knows all he needs is a crease, and he outruns a lot of people to the edge. First down to 10, Johnson gets a shot. It's great. Yeah, 
Gives the ball to Chris Johnson. Johnson picking his way forward. He's got the 30, the 40, midfield, looking for a block. He's at the 40, the 30, the 20, the 10, the 5. Touchdown! Tight! Chris Johnson. There it is. He's got sprinter speed down the sideline. And Johnson is gone. Every week, this guy comes up with another major highlight. Go. Two to Sam. Hand off to Johnson. See ya. Johnson to blur. Touchdown. Third and two after the timeout. Oh, a bit of Woo! And Johnson streaking down the sideline. 32 yards has just put Johnson over 1,000 yards rushing on the season in the ninth game of the year. He joins the great Earl Campbell and Eddie George back-to-back 1,000-yard -back seasons to start their careers. It's a six and four. Johnson got a block from his wide receiver. Stays on his feet right through the tackle of pushing and explodes down the sideline. No one really knew what Chris Johnson was going to be in the pros. And then he goes on to have one of the greatest seasons the running backs ever had. Johnson dances to the left, look out for the speed, it's Chris Johnson! Chris Johnson is arguably the hottest running back in the NFL right now. You'll see right here, look at the quickness, look at the lateral agility, making people miss and they can get him in the open space and oh, he finishes. Right in, it's Chris Johnson. Trying to bounce it outside. Has a crease, has an opening. Cuts back. And Chris Johnson is into the end zone. Anybody around the league knows what he's capable of doing. Hey, hey Mike, we've, we've covered a lot of great running backs this season. This guy is playing out of his mind. And this guy's as good as it gets right now in the NFL. First down chased by Chris Long. Dumps it out to Chris Johnson. He's got some space, folks. Cuts back to the open. Is he a guy we should consider in the MVP discussion? You have to. When you have a weapon like Chris Johnson, his ability to take it to the end zone every single time he touches the ball has really improved the chances. And when you're talking about a guy ultimately having a chance to break the single season rushing record, he has to be involved in that conversation. Johnson again. Chris Johnson. How good is he? Handoff to Johnson. And Johnson finds a hole. Diving. He's got it. Touchdown, Johnson. It's a new NFL record for yards from scrimmage for Chris Johnson, topping Marshall Falk. And yes, it's a new franchise record for rushing yards in a season. Chris Johnson topping Earl Campbell. And he's got it. Chris Johnson is now a member of the 2,000-yard rushing club. Chris Johnson has done it. He has gone over 2,000 yards, becoming the sixth player in NFL history to do it. To the Titans, they've got a minute 56 to work with here in the first half. Handoff, Chris Johnson! Johnson is gone! Chris Johnson takes it the distance. 76 yards for the touchdown. He is at a different level. Yeah, you just can't afford to miss a tackle in the secondary. He's a forgotten guy in, the, I guess, the lore of NFL. It's Chris Johnson. Oh, how does he find the room? Steps by him on the Cowboy. Takes off to the 14. As coach to see it at its regularly scheduled time. It's Chris Johnson breaks free. Jenkins has an angle on him, shoves him out. Well, look at that. Just the patience and the speed. Feet, he can dance, he just glides behind the line of scrimmage and he waits to see the opening. And it's like, no matter how you play against him, sooner or later, he's gonna get a big one. 
Pop it outside, this inside. Chris Johnson over 100 and into the end zone for a touchdown. Johnson picks up a perimeter block and he's gone. You're a defensive coordinator against the Tennessee Titans. You hold your breath every time he touches it because it can go the whole way. He looks like a small little running back, but once he puts that ball in his hands, he's just he just bounces, he just floats. Some room to work with. Good block by Young on the near side, and Johnson able to turn it upfield, and he goes all the way. Shotgun formation, third and two. Johnson right up the middle. And Johnson is in for the touchdown. There you go. Another big play guy is Chris Johnson. Johnson turns the corner. Watch the flow. You'll see it. He sees it as well. And now cut all the way back. Ooh, nicely done inside of Francisco. And then use your speed. For Indianapolis. Chris Johnson on a first and ten. Runs right around Lacey and keeps going. Chris Johnson. Watch Kenny Britt right down here. Get your safety. Bang, right there. He gets, once he gets the safety, now you're one on one with the corner. And then there's a jock strap playing right down there. That would be Lacey's. And then he runs away from everybody else. First and 10. And here is Chris Johnson. We got a block from Stevens. This is what he does so well. A foot race down the Four yards, then five yards, and then 50 yards. Look at the breakdown. He just runs right by Brian Bushin, and he's going to run by Monk. And we said like a hitter in baseball, all he needs is one swing of the bat. Look at the stutter step. And then he's off to hitting a home run and running through your secondary. Out as Tennessee takes over. Here's Johnson, able to get around the edge. We talk about setting the edge, forcing him back inside. Chris Gokong takes that one false step, and Chris Johnson has too much speed. This is Johnson, now looks to make the turn. Another beautiful run. Right now with the team up by seven. Here's Chris Johnson, first down, trying to follow his blockers. Against Carolina. And he's going to break it here. First down, Tenard Jackson is chasing him and finally pushes him out of bounds. And that is the Chris Johnson we are so accustomed to seeing. He's darting laterally and then let him go. And he's as fast as there is. Outstanding play. First Super Bowl quarterback got the Seahawks there in the 05 06 season as Johnson bounces through the Buffalo defense. Still going to the 10 5. Touchdown! Watch again the patience, right? The see how he's just dancing around a little bit, then he sees the seam and now right there, it's over. Nobody is gonna catch him from that point forward. Johnson is not your ordinary ordinary bear with that football boy. He takes it and goes, you cannot close the gap on him. Johnson in motion now, some trickery from Mike Munchak. Darting inside Buffalo territory, breaking tackles. He has breakaway speed. Um, if you give him a hole, he's going to take it and run. I think uh, he's shifty. He's real shifty. Second and three. Johnson. Well, he has shown that cutback ability today. It's tough when you have a patient running back that runs a 4 2 40. He's one of the most patient runners I've ever seen. He'll wait and set blocks up for his offensive linemen. And then once they get on that block, he gets to hold on to my power. You know, nobody's going to touch me. In the loss to Baltimore. On the gift for Johnson. Weaving his way through traffic. Chris Johnson caught from behind. If you're out your gap, he's going to kill you. Antrell Roll said about Chris Johnson, he's the fastest thing on green I have ever seen. Over the last three weeks. CJ left side with some running room. Chris Johnson up the sideline on this opening drive. Chris Johnson to the outside and he dives in for the touchdown. I expected him to run for 70 yards or 80 yards every time he touched the ball because that's just what they got accustomed to. 
Give Chris Johnson looking for rim up the middle, finds it. 20, 30, 40, 50, 40, 30, 20, 10, 5, end zone. Chris Johnson, 83 yards, and he approves this message. Touchdown, Titans. I don't think he was touched at all. He just bounced it outside and then put on the Jets. That's the, the CJ we like to see. Here's the game. Still 10 20 to go, and Johnson with a big push into his second game. And he races right by the defenders, and he will go the distance for a touchdown. 80 yard run for Johnson. Who already has the NFL record for 80 yard touchdown runs. That is his fifth. I thought the way that Jeff Fisher described his running style was absolutely perfect. He said he's a glider that glides at 100 miles an hour. You couldn't stop him. It was just 80 yard runs every day. It's the home run by Chris Johnson. Watch Chris Johnson come and hit this crease. That's the last place Jeremiah Bell wanted to be in a foot race with Chris Johnson. If you make a mistake in a gap, forget about it. I don't know how many 80 plus yard touchdowns I've seen this man make. Chris Johnson, the only man in the backfield, and he gets the football. Cuts it back, and he's got room. CJ with the move at the 45, and you can't forget about it. He is gone. Chris Johnson to the house, 58 yards, and the Titans have tied it up. One man is not going to keep Chris Johnson out of the end zone. You get him to the second level of the defense, he'll make that unblocked defender miss. It's a third and seven for Ryan Fitzpatrick. They come off the edge with Flowers up the middle. Grab by Bailey. Oh, and look at this. Chris Johnson off to the races. Getting a block downfield from right. Getting a block downfield from Washington. That is a Tennessee touchdown. Anytime he gets the ball, he could take it to the end zone. He hit the hole, and it was all she wrote. Nobody touched him. And, and um, you know, he, he has that top speed. And once he gets behind him, there's no catching. comes in to take over and say to the special team star, Chris Johnson on a screen, has a little room. But Chris Johnson's in 49er territory. And there he goes. Chris Johnson is going to have a Titans touchdown. We've seen him demonstrate power. We've seen his ability to change directions. And of course, his straightaway speed is unparalleled. At the third Johnson to the other side. Johnson using his speed. He's in for the touchdown. You know, we know that he's going to get stopped here and there. But we're not going to get frustrated because we know at any time he can go 60, 70, 80 yards. In this fourth quarter, Johnson. Johnson finds running room. Johnson for the touchdown. Instead of Here's Johnson. And the second area. Kiss him goodbye. That's how fast he is when he gets to the second level. And that's the thing about Chris Johnson. Any way you get him the football, because of his great speed, it's a roll of the dice that you're not going to make a touchdown. If one guy misses a tackle or misses a or takes a bad angle, he can go the distance. One of the best home run hitters in the running back position in league history. I don't think I've ever seen a, a player as explosive. Johnson again, and straight ahead, Johnson. Wow. And he's in. Touchdown. See, with me, everybody knew I was that fast. They just didn't know what the right angle was to take. And even if they did take the right angle, I still I ran the angle, so it was just hard. On second and 13, Fitzpatrick with some time. 
Throws to Johnson on the backfield. Johnson, touchdown. Exact same position where they've questioned Michael Vick as the starter and looked for the backup. How about Chris Johnson? He takes it all the way for a Jets touchdown. When he gets any bit of daylight, he can stop, wait, and then accelerate and restart quicker than anybody in the NFL. Owes 10 million next year. Johnson into the secondary. Good dash by Chris Johnson. Using that speed as he breaks across the 30. Oh. And to the 21 yard line. And Chris Johnson cuts this play back. How about that move against Lewis Delmas? There's another one. Three times he's played against the Miami Dolphins, and all three times Chris Johnson has ripped them. First and goal from the six, and Johnson will power his way into the end zone. It's his longest carry so far is a bug. Trying to add even more than that, it will. Inside the 35. Still on his feet, down to the 29-yard line. Anybody who knows anything about that rivalry knows how high for it really is. Palmer dumps it off, uncovered is Johnson. And what a cutback! Johnson inside the five. My, oh my, what a run by Johnson. People forget how unbelievably fast Chris Johnson is. Ready, 4 2 4 40 at the combine coming out of college. He's not that much slower than that now. And on Chris Johnson again. Great cut. Johnson's got the speed. Chris Johnson, he gets chased down by Glover Quinn. The deep passes to start this drive. Trying to set the run with Chris Johnson. Bouncing off a tackle. Johnson picking up blocks. Might go. Will go. Cardinal touchdown. From the 30, Chris Johnson comes to the left. To make Gresham blocking again. Johnson may not have been down. He was not. Stays alive. And Johnson takes it inside the 10 to the 8-yard line. Johnson is into the end zone. Touchdown, Arizona. CJ2K. 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 Nobody can bring this guy down one-on-one. -on -one. Chris Johnson was amazing in his prime, and I think his prime was just way too short. Uh, a lot of young fans became Titans fans because of CJ2K. One of the greatest Titans draft picks of all time. One of my favorites, the call he provided a lot of great moments. The one thing I can say about CJ is that he never lost it. You never knew when he was going to bust a long one. He was fun to watch, and uh, he officially announced his retirement this week. Certainly, he ended up, he was a favorite on Madden. Every yeah. kid wanted to be yeah. Yeah. Chris Johnson. Been obviously, looking back, I mean, he's most, one of the most fun guys I've ever covered. Oh, so much fun. I mean, if you, if you loved the game, you loved watching him. Having had you as part of the Tennessee Titans is one of the great thrills for all of us. And I speak for fans, I speak for people in this building. Well done, sir. Well yeah. done, and thank you for coming back and retiring as a Titan.